Hey, hey! Here at the Motion Mill, I'm going to show you how to make a basic transition that you could apply to any footage. Create a new composition with your desired dimensions. Select the pen tool and disable the fill by holding Alt and clicking on the color box. We'll be using a stroke for this instead. Select your color and then make two clicks beyond the top and bottom of your work area. If the stroke isn't quite right, you can adjust the width by dragging this number. Copy the stroke by selecting it and pressing Ctrl C and Ctrl V on your keyboard. I'm going to make this stroke more narrow and change its colors like so. We can make it look a bit better by going to the Effects and Presets tab and searching for the Drop Shadow. Add it to your top layer and adjust the direction to line up with your strokes. I also suggest increasing the distance and softness. This will give your lines a sense of depth. And if that wasn't depthy enough, you could search for Bevel Alpha in the tab and drag it to your bottom layer. I put my bevel settings at an edge thickness of 17 and light intensity of 0.37. I also suggest opening the Transform tab on your top layer and moving it back a bit by dragging the position numbers. With the bevel and shadow, it makes the line look like it's at a bit of an angle. Now create a Null Object through Layer, New, Null Object. Select both your shape layers, then click and drag this swirl icon onto your Null Object. This will make your Null apparent, meaning the strokes will always follow the Null Object. Open up the Null Object's Transform tab and drag everything off screen. Click the stopwatch next to it to set a keyframe. Go a little further down your timeline, nothing more than a second or two since it's a transition. Hit the keyframe icon beside the stopwatch and drag the keyframe position again until everything is off the other side of the screen. Select both keyframes and hit F9 to set them to ease in and out. Then click this graph icon to enable the speed graph. If you want to know more about the speed graph, watch my keyframe tips video here. Otherwise, just drag the left handle a bit to the right to give the line a more sleek movement. The animation is done, but we need it to transition something still. Create a new solid by pressing Ctrl and Y. Make sure the solid is wider than your composition as well. The color doesn't matter because we're turning off the visibility by clicking this eyeball icon. With your solid selected, get the pen tool and make a mask that lines up with the bar and then goes beyond the composition window. Click and drag the solid swirl icon to the null object as well, so it moves with the bar. Now let's make the slot for our footage. Create a new composition the same size as your transition, and then completely ignore it and go back to your transition composition. In your project tab, drag the new composition into your timeline under the invisible solid. Click on the None tab under Track Matte and change it either to Alpha Matte or Alpha Inverted Matte, depending on if you want your footage to appear or disappear with the bar. Time to test this transition. Open your new composition again and drag your footage or image into its timeline. Just make sure it properly fits in the composition window. You can now see how it looks in the transition composition. Uh oh. If this happened in your transition, it means that the solid layer isn't as large as its mask. To fix this, use the Select tool and drag this square and make your solid wider. Just remember to adjust your mask again so that it still lines up with the bar. That's more like it. Once you're satisfied with how it looks, clear out any footage and save your project. Now you could drag this project file into any other After Effects project and have instant access to this transition. If you want to transition from one scene to another, put your transition composition into a new composition and place the next scene underneath it. If you found this tutorial helpful, let me know and be on the lookout for more here in the Motion Mill!